Hello, my name is Senior Master Sergeant Brent Kenny. I'm with the 53rd Air Traffic Control Squadron here at Robbins Air Force Base. And through the Air Force AFWORKS program and, and working with the RSO office, we were able to uh, work with the civilian sector to acquire uh, the solar, actual solar fabric. The, the solar cells are not just like your typical panels that you see like on the, on the roadside. Um, so with this, it's uh, give, has given us the ability to become more lighter and leaner as we, uh, as a mobility unit, uh, respond to either downrange or uh, home, home country uh, incidences. Hey, finger tight for now. So had we had this technology when Hurricane Michael uh, devastated Tyndall Air Force Base, it would have given us the capability to be able to move a lot leaner because one of the biggest and heaviest things that we take with us every time we go out the door is our own fuel. So having this, this uh, system right here will give us the capability to estimatedly to cut our fuel savings by almost 50%. All right, hold on for a second. And, uh... So working with the RSO office, when we initially laid out this plan for them and, and through the AFWORKS program, uh, this system is actually modular. So we, we actually designed a 10 kilowatt system, uh, which is almost enough to power the average home. Uh, so as, as our needs grow, we can actually add additional solar cells and they just connect together uh, to provide more power for, for the unit. So from any of the uh, deployable assets that we have from our mobile air traffic control tower all the way to new deployable assets and new uh, mission sets that we're spinning up here in the 53rd, this is going to become a, a tremendous asset for us as we move forward in the future.